Pupu Kaltin, established in 1977 in East Kalimantan, is the largest fertilizer company in Indonesia, and one of the holding members of PT Pupuk Indonesia Persero, which produces 3.4 million tons of urea per year, 2.7 million tons of ammonia per year, and 350,000 tons of NPK per year. Pupuk Kaltim has done various efforts in implementing the Making Indonesia 4.0 program, launched by the government in 2016. In 2020, Pupuk Kaltim became one of three companies in Indonesia, designated as a national lighthouse in the application of Industry 4.0. The long journey heading to Industry 4.0 began with the construction of a pneumatic-based plant from 1979 to 1989, which then continued with the construction of a DCS-based plant from 1999 to 2004. To improve the competitiveness of the company, Pupu Kaltim started its digital transformation through an information technology update in 2007. With the construction of Factory 5 in 2011 and inaugurated in 2015, Pupu Kaltim has a new sophisticated factory, which is more efficient in raw materials and energy consumption, and has the largest production capacity compared to other Pupu Kaltim's factories. Together with Pupu Indonesia as the holding company, Pupu Kaltim started business process integration in 2015 through the implementation of Enterprise Resources Planning, which was launched in 2016. 2016 was the beginning of the Industry 4.0 initiative through the preparation of the IT Master Plan and IT Roadmap, which contains five-year plans for IT infrastructure and application development. From 2017 to 2021, Pupu Kaltim has successfully implemented several use cases of Industry 4.0 including smart production, smart distribution, digital performance management system, and other use cases. The implementation of smart production in Pupu Kaltin, done in several activities such as proactive and effective maintenance, as well as monitoring of the health of factory assets. The increase of production rates and real-time performance evaluation is done through an integrated application system which gives all work units access to historical factory operational data to implement a cost leadership strategy. Pupu Kaltim also monitors and evaluates the production cost of each factory periodically. Moreover, automatic calculation of ratio and energy consumption done in the system also helps to measure the energy and raw material efficiency. Smart production also provides dashboard that can help the middle and top management see the overall integration, performance, and energy efficiency to support their decision-making process. Pupu Kaltim has also implemented smart distribution that enables management and other stakeholders to monitor the product availability in all marketing areas in real time from production line to retailers through the implementation of distribution planning and control system and distribution requirement planning system for fertilizer distribution. Smart distribution also includes Pay Ka Te Siet, an application that provides field officers with related data and features such as event reporting and activity monitoring. Digital Performance Management System helps simplify and speed up top management access to comprehensive information about company performance such as production, sales, finance, investment, human resources, and general data, which can be accessed anytime anywhere. Pupu Kaltim also implemented smart farming using Precision Agriculture Platform for Oil Palm or Crazy Palm, and Integrated Farming Solutions or iFarms, which is a digital agricultural solution with a holistic approach to supporting national food security. The application of Industry 4.0 key technologies helps Pupu Kaltim to minimize the unscheduled shutdown duration and frequency, as well as improve energy efficiency, production rate, plant reliability index, distribution cost efficiency, labor productivity, and operational cost efficiency. Pupu Kaltim is always committed to providing high-quality products and is ready to become a world-class agrochemical and petrochemical company that is highly competitive and sustainable and contributes to national food security.